Integrated Pest Management IPM, is a sustainable approach to managing pests in agriculture and gardening that focuses on preventing pest problems and minimizing pesticide use through a combination of biological, cultural, physical, and chemical control methods. IPM aims to protect crops and minimize damage while reducing risks to human health, beneficial organisms, and the environment. Here are the key components and principles of integrated pest management and its role in organic gardening. Monitoring and identification. The first step in IPM is to monitor pest populations and identify the specific pests present in the garden. This involves regular inspection of plants, traps, and monitoring devices to detect pest activity and assess population levels. Accurate pest identification is crucial for selecting the most appropriate control measures. Preventive measures. IPM emphasizes preventive strategies to reduce the likelihood of pest outbreaks. This includes practices such as crop rotation, proper plant spacing, selection of pest-resistant varieties, and maintaining healthy soil and plants through organic soil amendments and fertilizers. By creating conditions that are less favorable to pests, preventive measures help minimize the need for reactive pest control. Cultural controls. Cultural practices play a central role in IPM by altering the environment to make it less hospitable to pests. This may involve practices such as intercropping, mulching, companion planting, and crop diversification to disrupt pest life cycles, attract beneficial insects, and improve plant resilience. Cultural controls promote biodiversity and ecosystem balance, reducing the likelihood of pest outbreaks. Biological controls. Biological control involves the use of natural enemies, such as predators, parasites, and pathogens, to suppress pest populations. Beneficial insects, birds, and other organisms can be encouraged to establish and thrive in the garden through habitat management, conservation strategies, and the use of biological control agents like predatory insects or microbial insecticides. Biological controls target specific pests while minimizing harm to non-target organisms and the environment. Mechanical and physical controls. Mechanical and physical controls involve the use of physical barriers, traps, handpicking, and mechanical devices to physically remove or exclude pests from the garden. This may include techniques such as row covers, barriers, netting, and traps to protect plants from pest damage or prevent pests from accessing vulnerable areas. Mechanical controls are selective and reduce reliance on chemical pesticides. Least toxic chemical controls. While chemical pesticides are used as a last resort in IPM, their use is minimized and carefully regulated to reduce environmental and human health risks. When necessary, organic-approved pesticides derived from natural sources, such as botanical extracts or microbial agents, are preferred over synthetic chemicals. Pesticides are applied judiciously and targeted to specific pests, minimizing the impact on beneficial organisms and non-target species. Overall, Integrated pest management offers a holistic and sustainable approach to pest control in organic gardening by integrating multiple strategies and minimizing reliance on chemical pesticides. By promoting ecosystem health, biodiversity, and environmental stewardship, IPM helps maintain a balanced and resilient garden ecosystem while effectively managing pest populations.